They have the remote. I think that sums it up. They have the remote. I never had the remote. When I, if I had the remote, my dad came in the room, I would drop it like a hot weapon. Just wipe the prints off. Like, I'm sorry, this was on when I came in here. I did not, this, I wasn't sitting there. That's your seat. That is, I never sit there. I don't even know why I'm talking to you. You didn't say anything to me. I, I am sorry that I addressed you out of turn. I'm gonna dismiss myself. Enjoy Miami Vice. Now you don't get the remote. They don't cough it up. You know, they think you're gonna slip into their world, start watching what they're watching, right? My kids are like, you wanna watch this? Like, yeah, I wanna watch this kid, watch another kid play a video game and talk about it. Yeah. I love that, how he's up in that square with the headset on. I am following everything. This is, makes complete sense to me. Can we do this for another half hour and then watch some kids run around a mansion and flood it with balls? Maybe they can sell us some t-shirts. And then I want to watch two hands opening a present. But I don't want to see any faces. I just want to see hands opening packages because that is so satisfying to me. Have you heard kids talk like that now? Like, that's so satisfying. That, you like pop open a bag like, oh, that's so satisfying. That. I was playing cards with my son. I was shuffling a deck. He's like, do that on my hand. I was like, get the hell away from me, you freak. Playing Uno. Whatever you go now, they gotta sell these kids poppets and just. They gotta calm themselves down with the chew toy in the corner. And we just act like everything's normal. Yeah, you guys are good. You're good. Go back in your hoodie. Everything's fine. No, it's good. Go back in your hood. We're good. Everything's okay. Every kid lives inside a hoodie now. Everything comes with it. My son's lunchbox came with a hoodie. <laughs> and that's where they hide from all the pain. Every kid's in a hood and they come out every now and then looking for chicken nuggets. Just... <laughs> and you try and engage them, like, hey, what's up? <laughs> oh. I'm worried about the kids. I don't know, you know? My eight-year-old smokes. He's drinking. <laughs> They've been through a lot, right? I was trying to tell him the other day, did you, do, did you finish your homework? He's like, F off! <laughs> He's like, I want the first grade at my kitchen table. How about you? Jeez, relax. Just want to know if you're staying on top of things. Do you have to wear a mask all of 1983 when you were seven? Huh? Get out of my face. UFOs are real. Think about it. All right, sorry, man. Be you. No, we try and keep them comfortable, though, right? Keep them in their dry fit. They're always in the loose-fitting apparel, right? End of the day, so I was like, hey, getting ready for bed. Like, they're ready. They are ready. They are always ready to lay down. They live in pajamas. They're going through life better than Hef. <laughs>